briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 2004 case of Smith v. Texas, the Supreme Court of the United States addressed the issue of jury consideration of mitigating evidence in capital murder cases. The case involved Leroy Slather Smith, who was convicted of capital murder and sentenced to death by a Texas jury. Smith argued that the jury's instructions violated his rights, as they did not allow for adequate consideration of his mitigating evidence, thereby subjecting him to cruel and unusual punishment. Although Texas law permitted juries to consider any evidence that could mitigate a defendant's sentence, the instructions given in Smith's case limited the jury's ability to weigh such evidence. The Texas Court of Criminal Appeals denied Smith's petition for post-conviction relief. However, the Supreme Court reversed this decision, finding that the jury had not been able to properly assess Smith's mitigating evidence due to the instructions they were given. As a result, the Supreme Court overturned the Texas Court of Criminal Appeals' decision and ordered a new review of the case with proper consideration of the mitigating evidence. The court concluded that Smith's constitutional rights had been violated due to the jury instructions and that any mitigating evidence should have been taken into account during sentencing. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.